Hey, KIC here. Welcome back to the Life and Bunker No Pause Maximum Speed Challenge. Uh-oh, we have some slight issues coming up very quickly, I think. Ah, oh, crud. I've also been ignoring this thing. Incubator! Incubate it up. We need more babies. So, make more babies. Thank you very much. How are we doing on power up here, anyway? Power, I've talked about adding another incubator, and I just haven't gotten around to doing that. So we have plenty of power, I think. How much do you take? You only take 40? Wow, that's nothing, and we don't... I don't know that we're going to have... Nope, we're not going to have enough water left, because we just added this grain thingy-majigger at the end of the last episode. So let's go ahead and build another water pump. Why not? I say why not. Uh, actually, because we don't have any concrete flooring. That's why not. Let's go ahead and queue this stuff up. Let's just... here. Someone will go ahead and demolish all of that. Let's check on our floor number three. We started looking at this on the last episode. We have a little bit of work going on down here. We have two mining machines that are extracting minerals, some grabbing some ore for us to work with. Where is the other mineral patch? Do we not have a third one down here? Oh, it's way over here. Oh, that's going to be a bit of a long haul, isn't it? Well, let's go ahead and open it up. We'll do it. It's fine, and then we need to queue up some more floors for this particular side of the world. Let's get some regular uh, blue floors. I've been doing blue floors everywhere on this particular playthrough, so we will just continue with the blue floor frenzy. I like the idea of that. How are we doing on our canteens? We had another one at the... actually two in the last episode. Look at that. We are using two different types of food. Sort of. Kind of. A little bit. Not exactly, because... We need more grain. We've already gone through all of it. If we take a look at research here, I think I've actually done... Oh, no, I haven't. Um, sure, let's do all that. And you know what? Let's do the rest of it. Whatever. All of it. I think we have now researched everything. Let's check. Uh, sure, whatever. Big reactor. And good. Perfect. That's everything. We have actually done everything in this game. So we, there's nothing more we can build. We have, how are our scientists doing? Oh, we need another scientist. You, you go science it up for me. And then, um, I'm kind of surprised. Some of these babies should be able to science it up pretty soon. We have one cook who's going to be retiring soon. So let's go ahead and have another cook. Your engineer, you're going to be fine. We don't have many engineers. We're going to need another engineer. We have plenty of farmers, but two of them will be retiring soon. There would be the babies. We need to queue up some more babies. So let's go ahead and have some engineers queued up just because we need plenty of those. We need some options where those are concerned. We don't have any janitors, it looks like. We have one janitor who is likely sorely overworked. That's kind of a shame. Hmm. Yeah, we can't do much about that right now. I mean, I guess, uh, I guess I could put you on janitorial duty for the moment because we did kind of unlock another uh, option down there. How are we doing on the wall? Wall. Uh, why did I say wall? Floor front. How are we doing on the floor front? We need to build these. So someone will come down and work on this area eventually. We do have an air purifier, which is going to make life a little easier on everyone down there. I don't know that we're even going to need to go to floor four. We might get the chance. We might not. I'm not 100% sure at this point in the game because... Oh, you died. Ah, bummer. You, um... What happened to you anyway? Did you... Did you bleed out or something? Ah, cholera. You had... Oh, yikes. You were only like six cycles old too. Oh, that is so inconvenient. So we need to do a quick check. We have one builder... Two janitors. We need another janitor. No, we need... A, yeah, we'll leave it a janitor. One engineer, two cooks, three farmers, and one scientist. Wow. We need more babies to grow up and work. Join the workforce. I was going to build another... something over here. Another water pump. That's what I was going to build. So let's go ahead and do that. We'll, we'll queue up some floor to be removed right there. We only have one builder, so... We have to kind of go easy on them here. They can only do so much. And you have not yet opened all that stuff up, so... Oh, this is kind of dangerous. This is not good. We need more people to grow up and be able to work. We also probably need another shower and another toilet. We only have one of each. 
we've been rolling with one of each since the basically the start of the series, so or the start of this particular bunker, rather. I'm not that cruel in my total series. I have done more than one bathroom and more than one shower. Crud, we got Molman coming out like crazy. Oh, this is going to be bad news. And our builder died? Possibly? I don't know. Let's switch you guys over to janitorial. Oh, please be... Dang it. I was... Hmm. All right, well, whatever. It's more babies. Let's go ahead and queue up more workers. Where are you? Queue it up. We're just going to go random. It's going to have to be fine. We have our janitors over here. They're going to clean up those holes. That's good. All right, that was my main concern, was that we close those stupid holes in the ground. And then, do we have anyone at all? You need to be... Oh, boy, we're doing some major job shuffling right now. What are we doing here? One cook, hmm... Engineer, yeah, we are, we are not looking good right now. This is not pretty. You are able to work. That's going to help me out greatly. Not to mention you're going to help out your fellow bunkerites by doing that. Should have a few more who are ready to go. Power level is low. Where is that? Um, it's fine. Quit complaining. That one's fine. Oh, because that one broke. Uh, someone will fix that. I hope. Let's see. Do we have anyone else who can work? Good. You guys go ahead and get working. We have a couple of janitors. I think we'll be okay on the janitorial front. We're going to switch you over to... Whatever. We're fine. Don't... Ah, oh, crud. Yeah. That's broken. Our refrigerators need power. That is so not good. We need someone to go fix that very quickly before all this stuff spoils. Uh, don't spoil. Don't spoil. Or don't break or whatever's going to break. I don't know what's going to happen. Crud. Come on, guys. You need to fix it. Fix that one. Our grain is going to fall apart if you don't. What's going on here? Is there a pipe broken? There must be a pipe that's broken. Do we have any more engineers? Any more engineers? Ah, oh, boy. No one wants to fix that, huh? Let's put it on a higher priority then. Here, we'll put it on a two. That'll that'll get someone to come play with it, I, I hope. Maybe? Are you going to play with it? Nope, you're just going to stand there and wonder if your armpits stink. Oh, good. You are fixing it. Congratulations, you fixed it. What else needs to be fixed over here? I suspect there's all sorts of stuff that's broken that... These folks really need to be working on. You are kind of broken, so fix that one. And uh, anything else that's broken, you need to fix. How are we doing on the bottom floor here? We need more flooring. More flooring. Need more flooring. We need more flooring. 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 Need it. We do. Let's queue this stuff up for removal. That way we can go ahead and build some more power lines and build another mining machine because, uh, you know, we might want one. Oh, more babies. Baby it up, baby it up. We're going to queue up, um, sure. And you'll do that and we'll have the one random and that's going to be fine. It's going to have to be fine. Oh, I keep forgetting to put this back together. So let's build some concrete floors. We'll concrete that up. There we go. We have anyone else who's ready to work. Anyone at all. No. Bummer. Bad. You know what? We need to, since we only have one scientist, we need to turn off the research station. You just need to go be a doctor because we have all sorts of disease and stuff running rampant in here. So, yeah, you need to go make people well. Don't worry about researching the next, I don't know, VR station or something. Yeah, we don't really care about that right now. That does not matter. I think everything is more or less working-ish right now. You still have a floor queued up. How are we doing on this floor down here? You still need more floors to put down over here because you are actually removing all those walls. Oh, we got more mole men. Mm, you're going to die because it's one versus two. And you're dead. Hooray! You died. Crud. All right, new janitor. And uh, new worker. Hmm, how are we doing? Uh, I think you need to be a scientist because our one scientist is going to be retiring pretty soon. Wow, this is so not good. We don't have any cooks. We're we're not going to have any cooks here. That's going to be really bad news in a little while. Oh boy. Yeah, we're gonna have to make sure we queue up some cooks before too long, cause um hmm. Yeah. 
we're, we're going to be in bad news here. Bad, bad news. Probably should get that, you know, water pump place so I can build a second... Whatever those things are. I'm having a brain moment right now. Water pump! And then we need to connect the water to the system. We'll do that. And then we can make another incubator. We'll be able to do that momentarily. Let's see, you're under production. And then we'll put that guy... Um, Hmm, you need a concrete floor, don't you? All right. We'll queue up another concrete floor then. Why not? Why not? Yeah, no, we don't have any cooks. No cooks. If we have anyone who can cook, you can cook. Ah, boy. And we still have an engineer. That's fine. Although we are really running low on farmers and all sorts of things, too. And this is so not good. Here, let's go ahead and cook and farmer, scientist, and... Hmm, that'll work. And then we need to put some more floors down, concrete. So concrete that up. How are we doing down here? Are you ready to go down here? We can build that momentarily. We have so many building materials, that's not a priority. Priority at this point is to get the second incubator up and running. I know we're in cycle 43 here. We're uh, basically going for 50. Oh, it would help if I put power, in. Put power down over here, wouldn't it? Ah, uh, no, not there. Do, um, right there. That'll be good. And then we should be okay-ish momentarily here. As soon as those are built, there we go. That incubator is good to go. We're going to queue up three random ones for now. That'll have to be fine because we just need more bodies at this point. How are we doing down here? Let's go ahead and build that mining machine. So we'll queue you up and then we need to do some power. Let's go and run power cable to it. We're just going to go, come on. I cannot apparently draw a straight line to save my life. We're going to do that. We'll connect it to the other mining machine, even though wrong button. This one is going to be empty. It is empty. It's fine. We could get rid of it, but, uh, mm, yeah, we can get rid of it. Why not? And then we need to queue up some floors. So we'll queue up some floors and we still need to give some power to it. So let's do that. We're going to go ahead and queue up the power cables. That way we can continue to have all this stuff sort of work eventually one of these days. Yeah, I know. You need to get rid of that thing. And then once you get rid of it, things will stop working. And then I can put this last cable down and we'll be fine, I think. I think that's the way that's going to work. Let's see how we are doing up here. We don't have enough vegetable storage again. Probably because we don't have enough cooks to cook to go through all the ingredients. And we don't really have any tables with food. That's kind of a bummer. Uh, do we have any cooks? No, we don't. That's why. Bummer. Okay. No cooks. Not a single cook. Well, you can go ahead and grow. Because why not? It's too bad you guys don't know how to just grab food from the kitchen and run with it. That would be really super helpful for me if you did. Come on, guys. Keep going. We need some cooks. I can't believe how cooks are just turning out to be the problem here. We don't have enough scientists, so I don't have enough research points to specify what we want anymore. Because I only have one scientist, and I have him working as a doctor, or her working as a doctor. Bob. I'm guessing Bob is a he. He's working as a doctor these days. I know, guys, you're going to starve unless someone ages up to the point where we have a cook. We're kind of at um we're kind of at an impasse right now, really. That's what it is. Until someone can cook, we're not going to be able to do anything about this. Let's queue that up at least. How are we doing? We have anyone who can cook? You can cook! Go cook! Go cook! Go cook! Go cook for your life, yes. Alright, we have two cooks. We're going to be fine. Uh, assuming they go cook. There you go. Look at that. You're preparing some meals. Go throw them on the table because everyone is starving. Um, hmm. That was inconvenient. Where are you guys going? We probably need to do another shower pot. I keep saying I'm going to do that. I keep threatening to do that. Cat, hi. She's headbutting me. That's what it looks like. Yeah. Headbutt. Let's go ahead and queue up another... You are... I don't know if you are driving me in different directions or if I'm driving me in different directions. Let's queue up another shower pod. This is going to go, um... Right there. We'll do a toilet cabin right there with any luck they are facing the correct direction and people will be able to get inside them 
buy. I don't know if that's true. Hmm. I think that one might need to be moved. Here, let's go ahead and we'll disassemble you for the moment because I think that needs to be spun around. And then toilet cabin. There we go. Yeah, I, I didn't pay attention when I put that one down. So there. And then we also need to give it some water. It's kind of a pain. We lost someone who was um, actually alive. That's not a good thing. And we'll just connect you like so. How are we doing on the job front here then? Not terribly well, I would say, but we're trucking along. Let's go ahead and queue these guys up. Queue them up. Yeah, I know. We need food. We need vegetable storage. We need yada, yada, yada. We're working on it. We're at 46 cycles here. We are going to keep going until either everyone is dead or we hit 50. And everyone runs like heck to get out of here. Oh, crud. Our scientist is about to die. Ooh. All right. Well, when Bob dies, we need someone else to be a scientist because we need another doctor. I never did get around to making another infirmary, did I? I sure didn't. Oops. That's just going to have to be fine because I can't do anything about that right now. Bob, are you dead yet? You're not dead yet. Good. I don't want Bob to die. Just to be clear, I'm not asking for him to die. I don't want him to die. Bob's a good guy. He's been our doctor for quite a while. He's a good chap. He's a good fellow, but um, he's going to die at some point. He's down to one health. How are we doing down here? These are dead. They're depleted. I guess they're not dead. You're depleted. And then, how are you? You still don't have power. Why don't you have power? What are you missing? Oh, I thought that was a power cable. That's why. Duh. I didn't realize that. It was actually just junk lying around. Crud. I screwed that one up. That's all right. Oh, look at that. I think we have people ready to work. Uh, we need another cook. You can be a scientist. You can be a scientist. That way I can turn things back on. And here, let's go ahead and turn the research station back on. You guys can research away. That way I can make sure we have certain kinds of professions available to us. That would be good. I think that would be good. How's the kitchen doing? Vegetable patch. How's the kitchen doing? You do have some meals. You have some meals on you. All right, those all have meals. That's good. I feel better about that now. We have some cooks again, so things are looking good. How many engineers do we have these days? One engineer. Let's switch you to an engineer. We don't need as many builders. Three engineers. Nope. All right, we'll put you back on builder then. Two engineers will be sufficient for right now. Let's see. How are we doing? Yeah, I know. This is this is madness. We're, we're getting there, though. We are getting there. We got a snots infestation. That would be the nose right there. Old enough to work, old enough to work. All right, more workers. I like that, that makes me happy. You guys are ready to work? You better be. We have one farmer, two farmers. Two farmers, that's going to be good. Ooh, look at that, we have another cook. So we have three cooks. Mm, yeah, we're gonna be good on that front for a while, I think. We are, we are set. How are you doing? Let's queue up a scientist and a cook. It doesn't matter at this point. These ones are not going to be ready to work in time for it to matter, so we're just going to do random and let's go ahead and build that second infirmary i keep talking about doing that you are under residential so where are we going to put that guy um hmm right there looks good that looks like an excellent location for an infirmary it's actually a terrible location but i don't feel like digging up a ton of stuff to make room for it so it's going to have to be fine queue up some more babies here what are we doing on air by the way i think 39 is what we can maintain. One, two, hmm, maybe not. Maybe it's only 30. 29? Hmm, I think we'd better, just to be on the safe side here, let's go ahead and build another big air purifier. Um, we can't build that because you need a concrete floor. Of course you need a concrete floor. Why wouldn't you? Everything needs a concrete floor. Life is better with a concrete floor. Didn't you know that? Go ahead and pop that down there, and then we're going to switch back over to our life support. We're going to put a big air purifier down. We have people dying. That is sad. It's inevitable. It's what happens in a bunker when people only live about 14 or 15 cycles, 16 cycles. Look at that. We have a ton of air. We are good on the air front, so these are going to pop out some embryos pretty soon. We're going to go well over 30 when that happens, assuming all these people don't die first. How are we doing on the job front? You can work. You can work. Hmm, I think we're actually looking pretty good. We're looking not too shabby. I wouldn't mind more. Let's see, we added another builder, so let's go ahead and have another engineer. We have two cooks, three farmers, three scientists. We are looking 
pretty darn good. We haven't even bothered to go to the fourth floor at this point. There's no need to. I think we're pretty much good. We are looking really good. We probably need more vegetable storage, realistically, here. You're going to cultivate soon. And you're cultivating, so that's going to be... Yeah, we're going to need more vegetable storage. Let's see here. I believe that's going to be the case. You know what? Just to be safe. Whatever. We can queue up another fridge. Come on. We can manage this. Let's go ahead and do that. Oh, you know what I didn't do? I didn't notice that. I just now noticed that. I feel so terrible. Another bunk bed. You guys need another bunk bed. How do we have power? Is that going to actually be powered? Ah, perfect. It sure is. We'll change you to vegetable storage. Not that we really needed to. Is there anyone else that we need to? Look at that. Bob is still alive. Holy cow. Bob is still kicking. I hope Bob lives long enough to see the overworld. And Olga. And Olga. And Olga. And Olga. And Olga. And Olga and Olga and Olga and Olga. And lots of Bobs. Wow. We have, we have an overflow of Bobs and Olgas. We have too many. I think there should be some sort of law against having that many Bobs and Olgas. I don't know. It just seems like there would be. Cue you guys up. All right. Look at that. We are almost there, cat. It's time to celebrate. I would... Your, your head is over here. See, your head is right here. Your head is right there. You're kind of in the wrong direction. So get ready to celebrate, cat. We are going to hit 50 cycles here. Are you guys retiring or are you ready to work? Oh, you're ready to work. Exciting. Yes, let's get out of here. Ha <laughs> ha. Ah, that is pretty fantastic. Look at that. We actually won the no pause max speed challenge. And that is where I would call it a final video. Awesome. Thanks for watching. See you on another one.